once you get away from all the all the energy and all the positive vibe and so on you have to step back and say okay this is costing customers close to a hundred billion dollars a year you know is there enough value here of course it's nice to see the analytics it's of course it's nice to see some positive fraction in sustainability and so on but for hundred billion I just don't think SAP is yet defining its goals, its grand challenges, as my new book would call it, high enough, you know, to deliver significant value from that hundred billion a year that's going into this ecosystem. I'd say that for the most part, their products haven't kept up with the culture. Um, so, for example, I've taken a look at business by design, which is something I've been somewhat critical of for for years, really. Once they took it off the fast track. And I don't think it's an industry standard kind of product. I think it's functionally okay. I think there's design issues. I think um, there's functions in there that I have no idea why they're in there. I don't know that they're actually focused as well on the market that it should target, which to me should be the exact same market that say NetSuite's targeted at only. I don't think they should go anywhere else with it. I, I think that um, they're, they're coming in late in the game with it and regardless of everyone saying well it'll catch up everyone else is going to keep going they're not waiting for them to catch up so I think they have a whole lot of problems with uh, both the product and its release into the market and maybe even its market focus so and and honestly uh, that's a, it's an important product for them it's an important product for them and you know again I, I speak primarily from CRM standpoint, but I do look at the rest of it too. And, and uh, But from that standpoint, honestly, I think um, was put country to shove, NetSuite's probably a little better product than it right now.